Mark Ruffalo is the latest celebrity to speak for the Palestinian people, the Palestinian cause. Uh, he says, um, It is horrific to see innocent civilians killed and held hostage, and there is no justification for it. Uh, we pray for their safety as we pray for the safety of the innocent people of Gaza who are being bombarded and besieged. Um, strongly worded um, message and he's um, had more more messages as well on Twitter or tweets I should say um, supporting the Palestinian people, the people of Gaza and he's received backlash as well uh, he's spoken previously, I think I made videos in the past as well maybe 7-8 months ago now uh, it was good to see the people with a big following, uh, people who are known, um, despite maybe backlash, losing money, followers, uh, sponsorship and things like this, they speak and they choose to be on the right side of history and this is what we need. And just like I mentioned in, the, in one of the previous videos, just a few minutes ago, maximum probably an hour ago, um, Israel bombed a hospital for some reason. This just shows you the level of um, evil these people are. They are the enemy, enemies of humanity. That's exactly what they are. They're enemies of humanity. Nothing nothing about them is good. Absolutely nothing about them is good. They do not represent Judaism. They do not represent humanity. They do not represent anyone. They just represent evil. And we've seen Jews have been violently beaten. Synagogues have been destroyed or harmed or in some way um disrespected if you like um rabbis have been attacked whether it's by israel or israel supporters rabbis have been attacked um uh, verbally um physically so what else do you want they're not for judaism at all and they're going against the Juda the teaching of judaism they attack rabbis synagogues so what do they represent they represent absolutely nothing and they are they are just evil enemies of humanity nothing else